five suspects. An emotional ceremony in the Bronx today honoring a fallen hero. Family and local leaders gathered to rena rename a street for a soldier who died trying to rescue people from one of the deadliest fires in New York City history. CBSN New York's Rena Roy is in Belmont with more. If you take a look right above us, you can see that Prospect Avenue here is now renamed Private First Class Emmanuel Mensa Way. While the memory of what happened is still painful for his family and his friends, this was a moment of pride. With a brand new street sign revealed in the heart of a close knit community and a special Ghanaian ceremony, nice, nice. it was a bittersweet morning on Prospect Avenue and East 187th Street. Family, friends, and fellow National Guard service members remembering fallen soldier Emmanuel Mensa, who died not on the battlefield, but while saving others on a tragic night back in December of 2017, when flames tore through this Prospect Avenue apartment building, killing him and 12 other innocent people. His is a name, a legacy that will never be forgotten. I am forever grateful that I had a real life hero that I could not call my brother. His soul and his spirit still lives on. The 28 year old immigrant from Ghana was home for the holidays and staying with friends when the fire broke out. It was his first trip home since joining the army a year prior. His final moments spent rescuing neighbors from the suffocating smoke. We miss him. We, we, we hope that he was here with us to, today, but I know he's here in spirit with us. One of the deadliest fires in New York City history, it was all started by a toddler playing with a stove. Mensa's family says more lives may have been taken if he hadn't made several trips in and out of the burning building, telling us he saved multiple people, including four children. For him uh, to do what he did and then what the city is doing for him, uh, as well as the family and in the neighborhood, I think uh, it's an honor. And I think he, he's, he will be happy. And his father, who you just heard from, still lives here in the neighborhood and says every single time he walks by this sign, he will be proud and reminded that his son died a hero. In the Belmont section of the Bronx, Rena Roy, CBSN, New York.